Hi, hi everyone. Today in this video, I'll discuss one of the problem in Turing machine. One such problems is TM Turing machine accepting the same number of zeros and ones. Right. That the problem is like this. Design a Turing machine. Design a Turing machine for accepting same number of zeros and ones. That means x belong to it accept x as zeros and ones, any number of zeros and ones, such that number of zeros should be equal to number of ones in a given string. So let us see some of the examples of the given string. Same number of zeros and ones. Right. Look at this string as taken here. In this string is there is one zero one one is there, right? Same number of zeros and same number of ones. In the similarly, one zero also having a same number of zeros and ones. In this case, zero one zero one. It also has a same number of zeros and ones. So another string is one one zero zero. It has also two ones and two zeros are there. And other string as well. Okay, it also has three ones and three zeros are there. Right. So what you observe this in given this these strings, the one zeros equal number of zeros and equal number of ones. The appearance of the zeros and ones will not be same. The wherever the zeros and ones will be appear, but given string should have equal number of zeros and equal number of ones. Right. So that's the the meaning of the meaning of this given problem. I have taken one of the uh, string in this. Uh, it has the same number of zeros and same number of ones are there. So it has not start with a zero. It is start with a one. But though it has equal number of zeros and equal number of ones. As you all know that the problem will start with the blank, right? It is uh, both beginning with the blank symbol. The blank symbol is indicated by delta and ending with the given string is delta, right? As soon as you start ending with the delta, that means there is no more symbol in the given string. Okay. Try to understand before designing a uh, Turing uh, transition diagram of Turing machine. Let us understand the logic. Logic will be like this, right? So always the uh, pointer is pointed to the beginning of the given string. It is start with the delta. That means it is indicated that there is you have to move one step to the right. Read that uh, delta and moving one step to the right, right? So you keep moving always, uh, right? Read the leftmost sim. Uh, read first leftmost zero. Read first leftmost zero. Once you get the leftmost zero, replace zero with x. Right. So that's a meaning it. Then, even though there is no zero at the uh, beginning of the uh, string, but you have to keep searching first leftmost zero in the given string. Once you get that zero, you have to replace by x. You replace it. Right. Then, what is the next? step of the logic is keep moving to the left until you encounter a delta. So you keep moving until you get the delta. Then again move right, read next for read first leftmost one. So you already first leftmost zero is replace it. Then equally you have to replace leftmost one, right? This is the leftmost one, first leftmost one, you replace it, right? So what is the next? Uh, keep moving to the left until you encounter the delta, right? So there is here. So once if you leftmost zero is replaced by x again, leftmost one is replaced with this steps is repeating. So again, next leftmost zero replaced by x and next leftmost one is replaced by one uh, x. Sorry, x. Right. This steps is repeating until no more zeros and ones left in the string. Look at that. This is the next leftmost zero. Replace it and keep moving to the left 
and, uh, and keep moving to the right. Then next leftmost one is one that replaced by x and just to end of it. This is about the logic of the problem statement. Let move to the design of transition diagram in the next slide. Uh, there is another uh, example before uh, designing it. Look at that. Uh, look at this. Another uh, uh, problem is like this. Okay. Uh, first it is a 0 itself is a, the first leftmost uh, 0 replace it by x then next leftmost it is 1 and uh, next leftmost 0 is this one replace it then leftmost is 1 this next leftmost 0 and next most so this way you can I think you have understood that so zeros always need not to be start to 0 and any position it might become but that given string should have equal number of zeros and ones. The logic is always like this. First always looking at the first leftmost zero replaced by x. Then again re replace the next uh, leftmost one and keep on move, uh, keep on repeating these steps until no more zeros and ones in the tape. Okay. So I hope you understand this concept. So clearly understand this otherwise is very difficult to follow the step to construct the Turing machine. Right. So let us move to the uh, design for this. We have already constructed the design. I will be animated all this. So it is easy for you to understanding that I uh, using some of the things are color coded here. Uh, always start with the uh, delta. Uh, delta is reading it replaced by delta move one step to the right this con transition will take care of it and the pointer is moved to the next but the uh, one is has come here but as per as our lo logic is you have to keep searching the search the first leftmost zero in the given string right so so how do you move to the next this will be the uh, first leftmost zero so you have to move to the next right you have to use this transition right you have to use this transition one is replaced by one itself move one step to the right so this will take care the color has changed okay the pointer is moved to the next the now the first step of the logic is first leftmost zero has get encountered you have to replace by x replace it using this transition that means what is L, L indicate in this? So you have to move one step to the left. Okay. So but by that time you are at Q2. Okay. Again keep moving until you encounter the delta. So there is delta right and one also you have to read it right. This you have to read using this configuration. That means the transition one is read it replace by one itself and move one step to the left. Now once you get the left. So again you have to start take, keep searching the next uh, leftmost one right so use it this read the delta replace by delta move one step to the right so once you reach that you are at the q3 now it is one as that is the, that is the leftmost uh, one you have to replace okay by x and move one step to the left again it is a delta the delta is reading by the time you are at the q4 just q4 and reading the delta replace by delta move one step to the right so no color has changed now you have to reach to the q1 so then here it is almost all this uh, 101 once has been replaced it that x will be rep uh, uh, represented so you keep reading all this x using this transition function okay so the color has changes read the x replace by x move one step to the right again so there is one more x in the tape read the text replace by x move one step to the right okay now the next leftmost zero has come using this configuration color has changed to the green look at this right color has changed zero replace uh, read that zero replace by x move one step to the left okay move one step to the left right so move one step to the left by the time you are at q2 keep reading all this x until you get the 
uh, delta right using this transition okay keep reading all this x once you go to the delta then you can read the delta move one step replace delta move one step to the right so this direction will taken it that so here the point is move to the next again keep reading all this x because already you have changed that uh, zeros and ones using this transition keep reading keep reading moving one step to the right still you are at q3 then one has come so that means already the second leftmost zero is replaced then second leftmost one has come keep replacing that one by replacing x replace that by x move one step to the left so that means still you can search any zeros and ones are there on the tape using this transition keep reading and move one step to the left left and till you, once you get the encounter there is no more string on the left side just you have to come back to the q1 state using this transition come to the q1 right again you have to read all this still you have to search any more any more zeros or ones are there keep reading using this uh, transition keep reading all x all x all x and once you get the delta there is no more zeros and ones in the tape then still you are at the q1 delta has come replace the delta and move one step to the left right so again any more zeros or ones are there still you can scan right using this transition keep reading all the x move one step to the left so until you get the delta once the delta has get it that understood that there is left and right hand side there is no more symbol on the symbol that means zeros and ones so once you get the left side of the delta that means you have replaced counted all the zeros and ones equally then read the delta and replace delta and yes indicate is stop right so that is means you are reached to the ha ha is accepting state and reach the final transition so this is about to the this way you can be design the transition diagram for accepting a same number of zeros and same number of ones so i hope you understood this concept thank you is there any problem any doubt on it please you have to comment in the comment box and try to keep subscribe and share it for your friends uh, that will gives you more interest to do more uh, videos on touring machine thank you